Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Today I will discuss about the new curriculum for the medical student in case of phase one, who are starting their class in first August 2022. I am Dr. Tanjana Tachkia, Assistant Professor, Department of Physiology. Basic information about the MBBS course that means Bachelor of Medicine, Bachelor of Surgery. The course duration is five years and there is internship for one year. After taking admission into first year of MBBS course, a student must complete the whole MBBS course within 12 years timeline. This course is subdivided into four phases that means phase one, phase two, phase three, phase four. They are first and fourth phase is one year and half year and second and third phase is only one year. The first phase completion examination is known as first professional examination. What is the learning outcome of MBBS course? To achieve the national goal and course objectives, a series of essential learning outcomes. These are the graduation of knowledge of scientific basis of medical practice, the graduate as a practitioner, the graduate as a professional. Okay. In phase one, the subjects are generic topics of medical humanities, integrated teaching in phase one, the subjects are anatomy, physiology and biochemistry. For the assessment of our course, there will be in course that means formative there is item card and term and end course that means summative that is professional examination okay for formative assessment will be done through the results of item card and term examination which also weighted from integrated teaching and class attendance for formative assessment, 10 marks of written examination of each paper of each subject is allocated. In written examination for MCQ of each paper, 20% marks are allocated. Out of that, single based answer that means SBA which compress about 50% and multiple true false that means MTF type of MCQ that is 50 percent in formative and summative assessment of all subject of MBBS course. There will be separate answer script for MCQ part of examination. Total number of MCQ will be 20 for 20 marks out of which 10 marks for SBA and 10 marks for MTF. The written examination of each paper 70 percent marks are allocated out of 70 marks structure as a question that means seq will be around 25 percent along with short answer question that is seq around 75 percent in formative and summative assessment of all subject of mbbs course oral part of examination that means viva and the results are published as per following gps system that means when 80 percent or above marks letter graded is a plus and grade point is 4 when 75 to 80 percent mark letter grade is 1 and grade point is 3.75 70 to 75 percent marks will carry a minus letter grade and 3.50 grade point 65 to 70 marks that is b plus and grade point 3.25 and 60 to 65 letter grade is B and grade point is 3. When less than 60 percent it is F that means 0. Eligibility for appearing the professional examination the certificate from respective head of the department regarding students obtaining at first 75 attendance in all classes that means theory, practical, tutorial and lecture class etc during this phase obtaining at least 60 percent marks in formative assessment examination pass mark will be 60 percent for past professional examination in written examination anatomy physiology and biochemistry which all of is carry 180 marks but structure oral examination anatomic 
carries 150 but physiology and biochemistry carries 100 practical examination anatomy carries 150 but physiology and biochemistry carry 100 and formative marks all of three subjects is 20 total marks is 1300 for physiology examination our physiology subject divided into paper 1 and paper 2 their content is they are affected total marks distribution is 400 for physiology examination in written examination 200 and structural examination that means fiber carries 100 marks and practical carries 100 marks there is divided of these marks common rule for examination university professional mbbs examination will be started from may and november no carry on system before passing first professional examination students who will appear first professional examination can attend the clinical classes before publishing results of first professional examination if any students fail any subject of first phase in first professional examination he or she will not avail to continue clinical or other class of second phase before passing the first professional examination in case of osp instrument equipments to be taken to oral board to ask open questions to the students apart from structural oral examination in case of structural oral examination instead of preparing specific structural questions topics will be fixed considering wide range of content coverage in internship which enroll for one year and MBPS graduates must join internship within one month after passing the final MBPS examination. Timeline for completion of internship will be two hours once after joining internship. In genetic topics, there is 16 genetic topics in medical humanities. This session will be under the guidance of principal and vice principal coordinated by concerned department and session will be delivered by concerned expert of the topics. Each session will be one and a half hour. Attending this session will be mandatory and will be reflected in formative and summative assessment. Genetic topics for phase 1, these are behavioral science, medical sociology, integrity of using social media and self-directed learning including team learning and medical ethics. The integrated teaching in case of phase 1, the teachers of all department that means anatomy, physiology and biochemistry must be present during this integrated session along with concerned facilities. The students must actively participate in this session and have to submit the summary of each session to the concerned teacher or department as their assignment. This assignment will be a part of practical notebook in the summative assessment. Students need to get some take home message for every session. Total there is 36 hours. Each session will be three hours for the first term these topics are coronary artery disease chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and anemia for second term diarrhea diabetes mellitus jaundice electrolyte imbalance and proteinuria for term three these are thyroid disorder cerebrovascular disease deafness and refractive error this is my channel which name is tachkia tanjina please all of you subscribe my channel Thank you for your patience hearing.